If you've been curious about the Astartes Overhaul mod, but are hesitant to install it, either because modding is new to you or you're worried about breaking something, the process is really quite simple, and we're going to run through both installing and uninstalling it, so there's no uncertainty left to be scary. I bet the entire eight-step process here will take less than six minutes to cover. I don't know yet. We're going to do it live. We'll see. Seeing as how I've gotten more than a few messages at this point, you know, asking like, hey, is this complicated to install? You know, like I've had nightmares about mods in other games. We just eliminate some of those questions. So step one, go to Nexus Mods. Step two, go to the Files section, download the mod. I guess you could use Vortex if you wanted to, uh, but why though? This is really simple. Click your manual download. Yes, you will need a Nexus Mods account. Go with a slow option. I've already downloaded this, so we're going to cancel that. Uh, both because I imagine y'all don't want to watch a bar fill, and this makes editing easier for me. From there, you're going to come back to the main mod description, scroll down past all the new shiny stuff, and join the mods Discord. Let me bring that over here. Up at the top left, you'll find the help dash guide channel. Scroll all the way to the bottom and download the online fix. From there, you're going to go to your downloads folder, open both of the zips. We're going to start with the core mod files first. You'll open up your Space Marine 2 folder. Uh, the default file path, presuming you're using Steam, uh, will be in the description. But it's your Steam, Steam Apps Common folder. So you'll find client underscore PC and server underscore PC. What you're going to do is take those same files from the mod, drag it over. It's going to ask you if you want to overwrite. Click yes or click replace. Done. Now we're going to come over to the online fix that you downloaded. You're going to do the same thing. Take the client underscore PC and the start protected game. Patch that over. Click replace. I would suggest doing it in this order. Every time I've done it in a reverse order or back in previous versions of the mod, bad things happen. Nothing that's going to break your game, it just won't launch. Or things with the mod will be weird. From here, you just double-click the Start Protected Game Launcher, wait for things to load, and you're done. Go spread the Emperor's mercy. So, let's say you've given this a shot, and you've decided it's not for you, or... I don't know, you just want to go back to vanilla for whatever reason. Well, it's equally simple. Open up Steam. You're going to right-click on Space Marine 2 in your library. Click Properties. Go to Installed Files. You're going to click Verify Integrity of Game Files. Once that's done patching, congratulations, you're back to vanilla. So I'm not entirely sure how long that wound up taking, just because I did cut out a few bits where I failed to put words in the correct order and enunciate, but I can't imagine it had been too terribly long. So, as I said, if you've been confused or worried or not sure how to proceed with installing the files just to get a taste of how the mod works, here you go. Enjoy. I've been Bald Squid. See y'all next time.